2011 John Deere Z655. It features a 54 inch deck that's in good shape. Has a 27 horsepower frequent strat engine with a brand new carburetor on it. has the central hydraulic pump with the tools, two separate wheel motors. I think this is uh, the last year that they did that uh, on these Z-Track models. Um, I could be wrong. Uh, only showing 165 hours on the meter, 165.2. Um, as far as all your uh, controls go, here's a seat adjustment here. So you move that over to move your seat forward and backwards. Uh, you've got your deck height adjustment here and a foot pedal to help bring that up so that once that's up, you can adjust the setting to the desired height. And so if you wanted it at uh, three and three quarters, you put it there and then drop her down. You can access all the spindles pretty simply. It does have reasonable spindles on it. Over here is the parking brake. Uh, if you have your parking brake set and try to bring in your sticks, it'll kill the engine. So make sure to release your parking brake before you try to bring in the sticks. Over here, you've got uh, throttle and choke. It is missing the little knob on the uh, throttle lever, but that doesn't impact operation in any way. Um, this is your PTO engagement, your ignition switch, and hour meter. Has a lot of storage and cup holders, although with a zero turn, it's a little bit harder to drive with the beverage. I believe it has a three and a half gallon gas tank on it. And then there's the hydraulic reservoir. Uh, the battery, I don't see a date on it right off, uh, but uh, seems to be strong. Got your fuse box over here. Whenever we got this machine in, we uh, noticed that the engine was surging. So we put some carburetor cleaner in it and mowed our property with it. Uh, hoping that that would uh, correct the surging. Uh, it mowed great and cut the grass great, uh, but it still surged a little bit even after we cleaned the carburetor and ran that cleaner through there. So we decided to put a new carburetor on it. It's also got new spark plugs and a new fuel filter. If you're interested in this machine or have any questions about it, you can give us a call or send us a text at 660-537-3588, or you can email us at info at richland-sales.com. Hey, thanks for watching.